Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Peachy and this channel is all about my Sylvanian Families collection. We're going to be having some more introductions today and this time it's my Bear Families. So without further ado, let's meet everyone. So first up, from 1987 and one of the families originally released when the range first came out are the Timber Tops. So these are brown bears. You've got the very traditional Tomy clothing. Um, so we've got mother and father. Then interestingly, these families came with older siblings, so I've got older brother and older sister. Then the usual younger brother and younger sister. Baby twins. Again, these are very much loved, so there's a little bit of a uh, shocking damage going on. She looks like she's going bald, bless her. But yes, very well played with. And again, the ribbons are missing on their um, baby blanket kind of outfits. But baby twins. And then grandma and grandpa. I love the grandparent outfits, I just think they're really cute. I just wish I had all of their glasses. But grandma and grandpa are just, again, a little bit smaller than mother and father. But I just think they're, they're really sweet. So yeah, this is quite a big family. I think that's all the characters that they released for the Timbertop family. I don't think they ever got sitting and crawling babies and things like that. I also absolutely adore this big bear mould. I just think it's so perfect. Like, they're still really, really cute, but they look super realistic. They look like teddy bears. They're just so large, I love it. They're really good to hold as well. They feel really good in your hand. So that is the Timbertop. And then also from 1987 and from the original lineup of families are the Evergreens. So they have the same makeup of family unit and they are grey bears. Similar sort of outfits, very traditional Tommy. So we've got mother and father. Older sister and older brother. Younger sister and younger brother. Baby twins. And these are probably the Tommy era babies I have that are in the best condition. They've still got their ribbon on their outfits. So this is what those baby outfits should look like. You should have a little ribbon on them that ties behind the neck and keeps them from falling off. And they've got the little bead on the front with the embroidery. But yes, clearly these guys did not get played with as much maybe and then and as such have suffered the balding fate but yes this is what those baby outfits should look like i'm probably going to get some um little ribbon and just repair um the ones that i have where the rib where the ribbons have been lost and then also grandma and grandpa I love these ones, they've just got such happy faces, they look like they're, they're giving a little smile. Then, from 1990, I've got the Huntington Honey Bears. So they're again, big bear mould, but they're like a slightly lighter colour. They're like a light honey colour brown. These ones are suffering some quite substantial flock loss unfortunately so that's mother and father and for this one I just have the, the core family unit mother father and uh, normal younger sister younger brother I love his little trousers they're so cute the pink check I also love the, the size difference from the, the parent figures to the cub figures. It's just such a good ratio. 
Then next up from 1992, again still in the Tomy era here, I have the Marmalade Bears. Now these outfits are just to die for, they're so dapper. Like look at his little bow tie and his little waistcoat, his little smart trousers. Mother's got a very pretty dress with lace collar and the apron. And then these ones have the like, kind of teardrop mark on their muscles. That's mother and father. And then got a sister, a younger sister and younger brother. And again, their outfits are just too cute. He's got this little sailor uniform on and the sister's got this little spotty dress, but she also has this little matching hat. These ones are too cute. I think these might be my favorite outfits of all of the bears. And then I've got standing baby twins. Pink and blue again, the babies are the, seem to be the things that were played with the most and we've got again some balding going on there unfortunately, but I kinda, it kind of is what it is when with the age of these things and like how much they were played with. And then I also have grandma and grandpa. So again another quite a large family. And then, also from 1992, I have the Bamboo Panda family. So again, these outfits are really dapper as well. We've got father and mother. With these ones, I find that the black comes off super easily, so um, the kind of the markings on their face are a bit faded with time and play. Got sister and brother. And then I've got two babies. So this is when we started moving on to uh, away from the kind of wraparound baby outfit with the embroidery to more the outfits that we're kind of familiar with, but these are still open at the bottom. So these are more like wraparound, what's like dresses? And standing babies. And then I also, they did a re-release of these in the flare era and I picked up the crawling and sleeping baby that were brought out with this family in the re-release so I don't think they had these originally in the the Tomy editions but these are flare editions that I wanted to add to the family because I thought they were really sweet and then somehow all of my bears are kind of um, ones that I got either in occupational set, accompanying furniture sets and things like that. I didn't get another full bear family until the Osborne family and they were originally released in 2014 but these are definitely the uh, epoch edition of them because I got them quite recently and this is now in the kind of more cutesy little bear mould so the mould switched over in the flare era and they just carried on with that they, they haven't made bears of this size and shape for quite some time and it makes me a bit sad because I really do love this mould like they're both adorable and obviously this one has much more of a kind of cutesy kid friendly factor but I just love this mould I just think it's so realistic while still being really cute so yeah I'm sad that they don't use this mould anymore at all I feel like there's room for, for both types of bear in the range that was the father and the mother, sister and the brother, and then I somehow have two of Jason, which I think is the little bear's name. One is the one that came with the um, one is the one that was sold as like the single baby and one is from a blind bag but they're in the same colour so I have twins. And yeah that's all my bear families. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you again next time, bye bye for now!